Imagine yourself here as natural cerulean waters lap against the shores of lush island landscapes. Amidst whispers of ancient mythology and legend, each destination and invitation to truly live and breathe the spirit of Greece. This isn't just a postcard paradise, and this isn't just our journey. It's yours to embark upon too. Welcome to Sailing Trinity Season 2, a Greek sun odyssey around the island in 80 days, where Martin, Sharon, and Taylor, better known as Sailing Trinity, and you might remember us three from last season, one that detailed us moving aboard, navigating from Italy to Greece, and an entire seven months dedicated to fixing and renovating our beloved boat. Now, here we are, ready to finally cut through the seas in a way that Trinity never could before. As you journey with us, you'll unearth a treasure trove of tradition and culture, discovered through the Ionian, Peloponnese, Kiklades, Dodecanese, Saronic Gulf, and Gulf of Corinth. This odyssey isn't just about us, we want to bring you as close to the experience as possible. So, over the next 80 days, as we bring modern and ancient stories alike back to life and onto your screen we invite you to set sail with us subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss a second of this epic odyssey and feel free to leave a comment below we cherish connecting with you guys welcome to episode one of sailing trinity season two without further ado let's dive right in and escape the ordinary together Find a little jobs before we disembark. Just go through our exit departure maneuver as a crew, and then we'll actually just set up the lines and start going. I think we have some new two way radios, we need to learn how to use those too. So it'll be easier than us yelling at each other from one end of the boat to the other, as they are known as. They're called um, marriage savers. Marriage savers, there we go. <laughs> anyway, it is our final day. After months here, five months in Provesa Marina, we'll have you guys set up with us for our departure maneuver. So it has been quite a few months since we've moved the boat, but I have faith in us and in her. She's plenty fixed now. We should be fine. And the sun is shining. There is very, very minimal wind. We should be chilling. We'll see how we go, crew. <laughs> Come along with us. Finally out into the water for seven months. You up the last of the water there. <laughs> We might as well, we paid for it. Yes, time to disconnect the hose. Yep. These are all things. They up go, two way radios. I'll push the tall key on the side. Breaker, breaker. One, two, three, four. Teaching them how to count. They go up so fast. Bring some fenders up the front to protect the bow of the boat because of the way that we are maneuvering out. And we just found a little surprise on the bottom of only one of our fenders. Need a bit of sunlight on that. What a beauty. A muscle farm. Guys, we have a new business venture. Yuck. Attached to the, the bottom of the fender. Tell me when you're ready. Have a fantastic day, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Take care. Bye. Nice to see you out there. You don't cross lines here. Okay, they're over that side. How's the dinghy? Now, the dinghy tailor, make sure the dinghy isn't going over the front of the boat. Just need to get us out. What's the smoke? I thought they gave it a rev. It hasn't had a good old rev in ages, yeah? That's why I gave it the rev to blow it out. High fives. That was pretty calm. Good job. Good job too. Good job. Hi, Provesa. Thank you for six months of lovely times. It's a beautiful day as well. Mmm. Look at this, we're heading just over here 
to an anchorage right behind the marina. Look at how good this feels. I'm really emotional. I'm excited to do this every day now for the next seven months. And I'm even more excited to have you guys join us. Telling some cool stories. I just feel so free on the bow. <laughs> you know, there's like tree huggers, well, I'm, I'm a mass hugger. There's still some snow on the mountains all the way yonder. How's the serenity? Fine, Mike. That's the serenity. <laughs> it's lovely. It's great to be back out again. It was a great undocking, disembarking from the dock. Crew did well. So we're out now on the Amberton Gulf. No hugging the captain while he's on the helm. <laughs> Next job. Next anchor. job is Let's anchor. anchor. Less talking, more anchor. Gotcha. My arch nemesis, how are you? Windless. <laughs> Let's get that locker open and ready. Ooh, hello. We got our new depth, our new depth chart. So we know exactly how many meters of chain we're putting out. We got our new chain as well that has all our lovely color markers. Feels so much safer. Hey Tay, that's Tay talking straight ahead of us. I'm gonna go in between them and the other boat. I'm gonna go in. Yeah. I'm gonna turn around. I'm gonna come back out. Okay, let's get that remote. Lovely. Hello. The windlass isn't working. The windlass isn't working. Okay. Sharon? Yeah. You take the helm. Just stay away from stay salt here. Go out here and circle around. <laughs> Today is deja vu day. Yeah, not working. All good. All good. Is it working? I won't decide them. Taylor, I'm going to drive up to that other boat ahead of us on the port side and start dropping around about there, okay? Yes, it's Redbird ahead, over. Confirmed. I'm going to be laying 10 meters of chain to start off with, so once I see the first yellow and breaker, I'm going to stop, tell the captain to begin his reversing, and then I'll drop the remaining 30 meters until we reach the 40, and then we should be good. We'll stop the boat and see if we hold. Looks very idyllic and calm here. I'm quite excited. There are the salties. Hello. Confirmed. There's about 45. Enough? Yeah. All right, we'll go see. Feel free to share any anchoring tips, by the way. Let me put this away. Oh, yeah, Tay. Two on the starboard trailer. Two there, Tay. Two dozen. There, watch your surface. There, look. Where? Oh, my God, they're huge. <gasps> Those are like the dolphins from The Simpsons. That try and take over the world with Lisa. Well, if we end up dead or over intellectualized, oh my god, you know what it is. <laughs> Very successful. All right, last thing. Let's close this over. How helpful was it having the colors? I mean, let me know if that. Closer, closer. All good. Back we go. <gasps> Season begins. Round two. Go Trinity! Bye! We're here! It's happening! We are so back. We're back in the natural habitat. Oh guys, wow. so very calm can you tell <laughs> we've got some pretty nice neighbors <laughs> check out that absolute beauty over there lovely it's our first morning on anchor since august I'm very very happy to be back on the water there's like this holistic internal shift that happens it was a blessing we learned so much during the winter i mean i have so much more faith in the vessel where should i put you come with me Let's go on an adventure down to the bow. Good morning! Hey. 
wow, the scenery is beautiful. Not the Mikel coffee shop <laughs> in front of the boat. I'm too zen to speak. We've even been watching the channel for long enough. Certified yapper. I'm just happy it's a, it's a beautiful morning. It's still spring. I mean, I'm still wearing a jumper. It's quite light though. And it's just, it's a bit cozy. What day is it? Do you know what day it is, mum? Thursday. Feels like... <laughs> 20 degrees and it was so calm last night it scared me it's like whack-a-mole boom bonk don't say hi <laughs> how was your first night it was actually very peaceful it was actually so so lovely to be back out in the water this feels like another world doesn't it about what two four six seven boats here yeah. including ourselves oh eight including daddy warbucks over there so <laughs> yeah. it's quite a few of us but it's still calm. Uh, we have our friends, they told me, we here last summer in about August and they said they were struggling to find a spot. I'm getting back to my duties. Bye! Button those hatches. <laughs> Down, boy! I'm going to follow Sush because mother always knows best and I am going to go and upload some stuff. Enjoy the little morning update. Talk soon. To the upload station. <laughs> Just in time! Look who it is! <laughs> Hi! Let me set this camera up. This gas. Forgot to have the road. Ready? Can I have a few? There's a handrail there, look. You take a large bite of rope, mm -hmm. push it through the do two half inches to pass around the person. One, two, three. With our dinghy well secured, our crew well zen, and Trinity well anchored, that's all we have for you this week, folks. After one year of our channel, happy birthday, six months in Professor Marina, and a morning that we've all been waiting for, season two of Sailing Trinity has finally kicked off. And we couldn't be more proud and excited to have you all along the journey with us. Thank you for tuning in to A Greek Son Odyssey around the islands in 80 days. Remember, this is just the very beginning. We can't wait to escape the ordinary with you. See you there, guys. Oh.